We got another Eminem bracket video. We'll be ranking all of his singles, the songs that were dropped off of an album and then put on there later, or sometimes not even put on there later. And we're gonna go through all these. For example, we got Not Afraid versus Lose Yourself. And yeah, we're gonna go off the impact, off the lyricism, off how much it changed his career. So yeah, let's get started. First off, we got Mockingbird versus Beautiful. These are two very emotional songs. I like that these are being compared against each other because if it was something like Lose Yourself versus Mockingbird, they'd be a lot harder to compare. I think Mockingbird has more of a story to it. I know Beautiful still has its story, but I'm gonna have to take Mockingbird off that catchy melody. You know, the story really keeps you hooked. Maybe it's just the nostalgia speaking, but I'm taking Mockingbird. So it advances to round two. Lose Yourself versus Not Afraid. I gotta take Lose Yourself. I mean, the impact, that's not even, no question there. I used to play this before football games on my iPod. Oh my goodness, this song brings back pretty cool memories. I wasn't even born when this came out, but I, I can still see the impact it made even on my generation. Without Me versus Business, this is off the same album. I'm gonna take Without Me. I think it's more, it's more played. It's definitely more widely known. I like Business. I think the intro is definitely a little corny, but yeah, I'll take Without Me. My Name Is versus The Real Slim Shady. These are two very iconic songs. These might be his biggest songs right here. I'm gonna take My Name Is. I like the comedic side to both of these songs, to be honest with you. But I have the Slim Shady LP on vinyl. I can't go against the Slim Shady LP. I gotta take My Name Is. Love The Way You Lie versus The Monster. Once again, two perfect songs to compare. I'm gonna take Love The Way You Lie. These songs are very similar, like I said. I wouldn't be surprised if you took The Monster over Love The Way You Lie. 3AM versus Elevator. I gotta take 3AM just by the rhyme schemes. I mean, that whole, it's a long song. It's got the whole serial killer theme throughout the whole thing. I love Relapse. I know this is off the refill, but 3AM is a perfect way to start an album after that skit. Hell Breaks Loose vs. Old Time's Sake. Both of these songs have Dr. Dre in them, but I'm gonna take Old Time's Sake. I know it's kind of going against what Eminem wants in Recovery, the album after this, but him and Dr. Dre both do really good on this track. I just gotta take it. Phenomenal vs. Venom. I'm gonna take Venom. I like the hook to it. Honestly, I overplayed it, but before I overplayed it, I liked Venom more. Over on the right side, I took Kings Never Die over Guts Over Fear. Encore versus Crack a Bottle, I'm gonna take Crack a Bottle. I don't really like either of these songs to be honest with you, but I'll, Crack a Bottle's fine to me. Now these two songs, Just Lose It and A Like That, man, they're bad. They kind of killed the whole vibe of Encore. I like the beginning of Encore, but this these like couple songs in a row, I think it's like four songs in a row. I just don't like them, it's just miss after miss. I guess I'll take Just Lose It, the Michael Jackson diss track. River vs. When I'm Gone, two very emotional songs again. I'm gonna take When I'm Gone, more iconic, but there's no flaws in River in my opinion. Both great songs. Shake That vs. Superman, I'm gonna take Superman. I think Superman has aged better. Shake That is more of like a club hit. That's not really my style, so I understand why you might like it, but I like Superman better. We Made You vs. Berserk. I hate both these songs. I hate the hook on We Made You. And Berserk is like a corny rock rap. I'll take Berserk, I guess. Stan vs. Like Toy Soldiers. This is a great comparison. I think I have to take Stan, though. But Like Toy Soldiers is very close. That wasn't an easy decision. I like how he ends the beef and he keeps like a level head. You can see the maturity from that song. But I'm gonna have to take Stan. Rap God vs. No Love. This is like the era where Eminem was trying to rap fast. I think No Love is underrated enough to where I could put it over Rap God. Rap God is good, but I think it's overhyped. It's still an amazing song, but it's not as good as people hype it up to be. But No Love is like never talked about, and it's the same quality to me, so I have to take No Love. On to the next round, No Love versus Stan. Stan's a pretty easy pick for me. I know I was just praising No Love, but Stan, the storytelling to it, all that's amazing to me, so I'm gonna have to take Stan. Berserk vs. Superman, I'm taking Superman. Berserk only went to the next round because I didn't like We Made You. So Superman any day of the week. When I'm gone versus just lose it. I don't think I need to explain anything. It's when I'm gone. Crack a bottle versus kings never die. I'm gonna take crack a bottle. I like Eminem's flow on relapse if you can't tell. So I have to take crack a bottle. Mockingbird versus lose yourself. Another great comparison. I have to take lose yourself though. If we're being honest, it's one of the best rap songs of all time. It's got a crazy impact. You can't overplay it in my opinion. As soon as you hear that guitar, you know it's gonna be a good song, so I gotta take Lose Yourself. Without Me versus My Name Is, this could go either way. I understand how you could pick one or the other, but I'm gonna take My Name Is, just personal preference. 3AM versus Love The Way You Lie. I was just praising Relapse for how much I like the flow and the rhyme schemes on it. I'm gonna take 3AM again. Old Time's Sake versus Venom. I'm gonna take Venom. I like the speed, the hook. 
Okay, your first couple listens, you might not like the hook. The hook grew on me. I like the hook on Venom. On to round three. This is what the bracket looks like. We got my name is 3 a.m. Venom, when I'm gone, Superman, and Stan. So let me know where I messed up, but let's keep going. Crack a bottle versus when I'm gone. When I'm gone, no doubt. It's got more emotion to it. It's got more of a story to it. You gotta go with when I'm gone. Superman versus Stan. Same reason as when I'm gone, Stan. I like the emotion and the story to it. Then over on the other side, my name is versus lose yourself. I gotta take lose yourself. But to be honest, right now, if I could pause recording and play any song, I'd play my name is over lose yourself. Then 3 a.m. versus Venom. 3 a.m. once again. All right, semifinals, final four. When I'm gone versus Stan, I gotta take Stan. Two amazing songs. It's hard to take when I'm gone out, but I gotta take Stan. And then over on the other side, I'm gonna take lose yourself over 3 a.m the rhyme schemes are better on 3 a.m but lose yourself is too iconic it hypes you up too much so for the final i'm gonna take lose yourself i know it might feel like a normie pick but if you zoom out you see i picked some songs you might not have predicted 3 a.m like i said i love relapse up in here crack a bottle made it all the way to the quarterfinals so yeah roast me in the comments let me know what i picked wrong but yeah that's my eminem songs bracket if you agree let me know down below if you don't also let me know up here i got more eminem videos i got a whole playlist of tier lists brackets reactions updates on his new album all that so thank you for checking this out leave a like if you enjoyed and peace out